This video is brought to you by OriginPC.com. Go to OriginPC.com for the latest in gaming laptops and desktops. OriginPC.com. Click the link in the description down below. And welcome back to Panic here on Rose Card Let's Play. Alright, so as we where we left off, we had two headless babies. So I guess we're trying to put heads on them. Alright, um, so you know what we have to do with each and every episode? With this game, we just press a button and see what happens. So, um, uh oh. Oh my gosh! No, not the Statue of Liberty! No, no, no! Oh, I just destroyed a national treasure! I'm sorry. Oh. This, geez, the booby trap switch was connected to the Statue of Liberty. Diagnostics would detect 22 more booby trap switches, and I just destroyed the Statue of Liberty. I'm a terrible American. That'd be considered terrorism, but this is just a game. All right, let's just try this switch here. Let's see what happens. Oh, how about that? I get to go on to the next stage. This again with the Mega CD? All the way back to the Mega CD. Oh, Jesus. Was it this one? Oh, my gosh. That's random. We'll hit the stop button, got me out of there. That's great. What the hell is this thing? It's a bunch of buttons. Wait, we've been through. I bet it went all the way back. Yeah, because remember pressing that button. What the shit is this? Oh, I think it was hitting this button got me out of here. It did. We're backtracking. Beautiful. Oh, check it out. It's a globe. Well, I guess we'll press, uh, I would say a switch, but let's just choose a continent. Well, let's choose this continent. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Okay, we made an ass of the world. Okay, what about this one? What does this one do? Ooh. It's shaped like a banana. What about this consonant? Ooh. Well, we kind of stripped the whole planet of everything. Uh, what about the switch right here? What does this do? Oh, it got me out of there. Cool. Whoa, look at all these clocks. Oh, I got, it's, I got both slap and stick. Cool. All right, well, let's just choose, we'll choose three o'clock. Or actually, no, that's nine o'clock, sorry. Nine o'clock spells... If anybody can speak that language, will you leave the comments down below and tell me what they just said? Three o'clock spells, I mean, nine o'clock spell Japanese stuff. I don't understand what they were saying. But, anyways, here's, uh, let's see what. Hmm. Alrighty. So that three o'clock made um, all of them go off. Let's try seven p.m. or seven o'clock. There's no p.m. or a.m. Just set the clock. Seven o'clock. Um. What? Ooh, made them younger. Okay. Let's try twelve o'clock. Got me out of there. Okay. Now what? Are you kidding? We're back to this? <sighs> Jesus. I don't know which button it was. I think it was this one. Let's see what happens. Ooh, a jukebox. Okay. Oh, let's see. I feel like listening to a golden oldie. Let's see what happens. Well, I get to go forward. Um, oh God, not this again. 
Was it this one? Oh, jeez. I gone backwards. That. Oh, my God. Um. Ooh. Okay. <coughs> hmm. Well, let's stretch them out. This lime green one. What did this one do? Any moment now. Let's find out. Lime green does what? Um. Made him really huge. Okay. Alrighty. What about this one? I think I think it was the the, the dark gray or black one that got us out of here. I think it did. Okay. Elevator. So I take it we're separated from slap, huh? So we're stuck with stick. I gotta find out which button gets us out of here. Oh, that's pretty easy. Now where do we go? Oh shit. Which button gets Oh, it's Tetris. And flatten. You know, I know that Nintendo at the time, they actually had the rights to Tetris, but I've always wondered what a good Tetris game would have been like on the Sega Genesis. Oh well. It would have just been Tetris. <laughs> I got Breakout. Oh, this is just upsetting. I had to go all the way back to do this stuff again. And there we go. Get the very last one. There you go. They got all these lumps in your head. You know. Okay. Alrighty. <sighs> Is it this one? Does that get us out of here? No. We're going to play a bit of Pong first. And it flattens them. Squishes them and then, yeah. Okay. Let's try the green one. What the hell? Nasty. Ew. Ooh. Vulgar. Was it this one? Oh shit, it was this. I just pressed that. You know, I really need to keep track of what buttons I've already pressed. Now, let's see here. Um. I can't remember. I don't remember if I pressed this one. Let's try it. Uh oh. What has two eyes and eight legs? A retired cannibal, of course! <laughs> that was a stupid fucking joke. Is it this one? What? I forgot. What did this one do? Oh, come on, for God's sakes. Ugh, you gotta be kidding me. All right, that's just very well enough of that. Is it this one? Can we please get out of here? Nope, some more damn breakout. I just like to take this time to say to you guys, I'm sorry for having such a crappy memory. You're probably already bored with me by now. And so much so, you probably already clicked off and are watching somebody else's playthrough of this or watching something even more interesting, like a cat playing a piano or something like that. Or who knows, might be a, popping off to watch, uh, rewatch a classic YouTube video, David at the Dentist. 
which I'm beginning to wonder if this is real life. But no, I did not mean to press that one. Oh wait, I'm finally out of there. Cool. Back to the freaking elevator. I just want to get out of this damn stage. I just want to see something new for a change, for God's sakes. Is that so difficult? Well, that's a shame. <sighs> I wonder. Okay. I just, just want to play with it just a little bit, see what happened. All right, so I think if I pressed on the phone button, did this do anything? Let's see. I'm curious. No, it just made the room it's smaller. Okay. Yeah, poor guy. So the phone button didn't do anything, so let's try one. Okay. Okay. Fine. So we all know what button I gotta press. Two. Ruled it out. There we go. <sighs> We're. Oh my god. Yep, well, we know what button not to press here, so. Yep. Yeah, I'm sorry, guy. I'm just trying to press the buttons. <sighs> All right, what about this one here? All right. Mm-hmm. All righty. This one. There we go. Oh, for shit's sake. Not again. Well, I was this one that got me out. Don't have me do all that again. It was two. And we're going to go right back to the squishy squishy. Back to the squishy squishy. <sighs> Let's try this one. See if we can do something different with this. All right. Good. Okay. And I know what to do here. It was this one. Yeah, whatever I press that one that one scene, quite a few scenes back, kind of put me backward. Yeah. All right, another one. Let's try. Let's try the telephone button just for fits and giggles. Let's try that. Okay. Now where? Oh, here's something new. About time. Uh, okay, we'll just choose a number. I'm going to say seven may be a curse in this game because we usually think that seven is lucky. I got a feeling if I press seven, it might trigger a booby trap. I'm going to press it anyways because you never know. Oh. Oh, seven is love. Oh, that's adorable. Okay. Well, we are pleasantly surprised. But let's try nine. This was John Lennon's favorite number. So let's see how cool that is. Hmm. Oh, it's a star. And it's uh, something else. 
Looks like Saturn. A jellyfish. A dancer. A something. Hmm. I am kind of impressed. Let's split the difference between seven and nine. Let's just go with number eight. Let's see what eight does. Okay. It does. Ooh. What the hell? It just burned out. <sighs> All right, let's try two. For the obvious reason for what two is. Well, two. Oh. Oh, little cute hats. How about that? Nice. Aw. <laughs> hmm. Oh, cool. That's awesome. <coughs> All right, so we try seven, eight, and two. Let's try... Let's try six. Six is a good number, I think. I shouldn't have said that. Oh, okay. Such a hand job, this is a hand job, that... Man, I got to stop hanging around on this street corner. No, I'm not making a joke. Four. Four, it's gotta be good. Oh, it was good, it got us out. Perfect. Now what? Underwater... Oh my gosh. I, I'm just pressing a random number. I don't know what that's going to do. Okay, it's drying everything out. Turning everything into a desert. Yeah, it's hot. Sorry, guys. Hmm. I'm going to go right dead center with this one. Now what happens? Where am I going now? Ooh. It's just a checkered board. Well, let's try this one. Let's see what happens. Something good? Oh, it's a Monty Python foot. Not really, but <laughs> you got to admit, that was pretty cool. <laughs> All right. That's nice. Oh, oh no, 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 you can't be serious. Oh, oh my god. This is ridiculous. It's one set back after another. Back to the freaking elevator. I press button two. Nope, I, it was this one. No, it was the phone. That's right. It's it's Sam. Okay. All right. So let's just press the phone. Sorry about that. It was there was the phone uh, button that got me out of here. There we go. And number four got me out. Four got me out. That's right. Okay, good. Then we're back to this. Okay, now let's press on something random. We'll try this this button here. Okay, good. I what? Oh my lord. Was it this one? Okay, that got me out. And now, a salad dish. Oh, I'm getting mad. I swear to God. 
Ah. Uh, this is driving me crazy. How about this one? It looks like it's broken. Got me out of that scene. Thank you. Oh, I remember this one. I think it was this switch. Yep. Okay. I'm sweating. So I'm getting. Oh. This is new. I don't think I did this one before. Let's press this button. Let's see what we get. What do we get? Destruction? Destruction. Well, there goes Buckingham Palace. I want to apologize to the royal family. I, I sincerely didn't mean to press that. The booby trap switch was connected to... Oh, Marcella's palace. So it's not. But whatever, I just destroyed something and I didn't mean to. <sighs> Alright, what about this switch? Maybe it, Okay, I should have pressed that one first. Back to the fucking babies again, where we started this whole episode. Oh, god damn. We come full circle. Ooh. What's this? Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Was it this one? <laughs> um. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh oh. No, I'm not gonna have that, guys. There you go. Get that out of here. That would've been very morbid, entertaining, but morbid. All right. Well, it's not destruction because we already had one. <sighs> wow, Mother warned me about nightmares! Of course. Anyways, let's just have another button. Press get out of here. Where do we end up next? Right back to the Mega CD. <sighs> you know what? I'm pressing it anyways, because I know that gets me out of here. <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This again, too. And. Was it you? Yeah, I'm out of there. That's good. Oh! Let's try this one. This is really interesting. I'm scared to press any more buttons, but, uh... Because of... Other... Oh. If I could only remember... Where I left my trunk. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I gotta admit, that was kind of cute. Now, this one. Oh, it tickles. Oh, pull the tooth. All right. Well, that's what a dentist chair is usually for, is make a person relax. And I'm out of the scene. Something different. And that's all right by me. But I'll tell you what, guys. Next episode of Rose Car Let's Play, another awesome video to get you through today. Sorry for all this backtracking, but hey, playing this game for the first time, yeah. Can't get frustrated. So, until you hear from me again, I'll see you on the flip side.